Hello student, how are you? Uh, so in this chapter we will talk about problems and how to we fix problems. But first of all we will start with the, the use of for, of, and with. Uh, he give you a sentence and in the sentence, in the, I mean in the, in the blank place, he would like you to put the correct tools. For, of, or, with. Okay? Uh, it depends on the structure of the sentence, let's say. For example, the first one is uh, a work for a big uh, for a big company. So, for is the most suitable tool to be used in this place. We will see B. Uh, be in charge dash overseas project. Be in charge of overseas project. And no... Um, هو مسؤول عن مشاريع شلون ما بعد البحار او يعني شلون انت مسؤول عن مشاريع او شغل بس يفصلك بينك بينك وبين الدوله اللي تشتغل بيها بحار اوكي او يعني it is a very far away country overseas i work overseas يعني انا اشتغل بمكان كلش بعيد اوكي ما بعد البحار يعني انا اكون شلون عبر المحيط الهادي او الاطلنطيك اوكي باي 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 مين شيب اور اي فلاي سو ان اوردر تو ريتش ذا بليس اوف ماي ورك سو اوفر سي ما عبر البحار سي بي اهيد ا بيج ديبارتمنت بي اهيد اوف ا بيج ديبارتمنت هيد يعني رئيس القسم او رئيس قسم مهم Okay, just like the, the head of English department, is not the one off. Be responsible, uh, dash making important decision. Uh, be responsible uh, of uh, of making important decision. A deal, dash complaints and queries. Uh, deals with uh, complaints and queries. يتعامل مع المشاكل والكوارز تحقيقات اوكي هذا very important how we use for of and with uh, there is a lot of youtubers has make already couple of videos uh, عن استخدام ال of وال for بس النقطة هي كانت ولا زالت انه هي نقطة تعتمد على الدب... يعني ماكو قاعدة معينة تحفظها على مو تستخدم هاي tools no it is something Uh, spontaneous هو شيء عفوي تتعلمه ما كل ما تطورت مستواك باللغة تقدر تستخدمه بال correct place طبعا وهذا الموضوع بقد ما مهم انطيت uh, تقارير او تقريرين عنه بالنسبة للطلاب اللي they will write a report uh, here in the same uh, uh, page we have match each verbs with a phrase okay يطينا um, شلون مصطلح او الى تكمله بالجهه الثانيه اوكي okay. for example solve a problem دائما تجي مصطلح solve with problem uh, connection uh, connect to uh, to the internet of course arrange a meeting uh, delete a, a file by mistake اوكي okay. يعني حذف ملف او فايل بالغلط repair a faulty telephone فهاي هم اللي يسموها How to match a, a, a sentence or a word with a phrase is very important and very enjoyable. It's being you know how your level of English uh, so far. Uh, okay, in the next slide uh, we will hear a conversation. Uh, it, both uh, speakers uh, speak in assistance and Vicky speak with the American accent. Um, عن مشكلة أن عندهم بالطبيعة مشكلة، أوكي؟ فا تتصل على ما تطلب مساعدة أو in order to get repaired uh, how they fix this uh, uh, photocopy uh, copier or photo um, yeah it is photocopier، أوكي؟ okay. so after that we will have a couple of uh, questions so pay attention carefully for the conversation or for the record of the native speaker. in order to be capable to do the exercise after that. Recording two. Hello, Johnson's Office Solutions. Can I help you? 
Oh, hello. This is Vicky from Kelta and Co. We've got a problem with our photocopier. I see. Did you purchase it from us? Yes, we did. And is it still under warranty? We got a three-year extended warranty. It's only a year old. Okay. And what seems to be the trouble? The paper's jammed, and we can't fix it. Right. Did you look in the manual? Yes, I've had a go, but I still can't fix it. All right. I'll have a look and see what we can do. Hmm. We can't get anyone there until late afternoon, I'm afraid. I'm sorry, but that's no good at all. We're very busy here, and we need this fixing immediately. Hmm. Well, I can't see if... Oh, yes. It looks like we might be able to get someone to you this morning. Okay. What time will they be here? I can't say exactly. Any time between 10.30 and 12. Is that okay for you? Well, I suppose so, if that's the best you can do. At least it's this morning. So, after you listen for the conversation between Becky and the assistants, uh, in which she is asking help in her uh, uh, photo career, um, we, uh, we, I mean, uh, we find that she needs the fixation uh, for her problem immediately, but since there is no assistance, he told her that it may be tomorrow, then after, at the end, he find a person to do uh, the job for her in the morning. So we will start with the exercise. Exercise number one is the photocopy is still under uh, granted. Yes, it has two years left on it is granted. And uh, when did uh, Kilty uh, and copyright buy it? Uh, okay, she bought it a year ago. Okay, or oh, has Vicky tried to fix it herself? Yes, she has already tried, but she did not succeed. That's why she called uh, a company in order to do the job. When is she told someone can come for fix it? He told her that there is a person. She want a person immediately, but he told her that they will send person in the morning between uh, 10.30 to 11. What time does she finally agree? Uh, yes, yeah, she's agree on the time which is between 10.30 to 11. Now, the second exercise, he asked us to be correct, okay? Uh, how you would describe the attitude of the assistant VK speak to? Is he helpful, professional, unfriendly, or uncooperative? Uncooperative, yeah, Imam Ta'awan. Actually, he was very helpful and very professional. He speak in a very professional tone, uh, um, and he helped her at all at, at the end. Even even he was so busy, or, and she want uh, the repair to be immediately. But he find um, a solution for her by arranging with the person in the morning. Three. How satisfied is Vicky with the service she received? Pretty correct for your answer. She's not very satisfied. Uh, she's quite satisfied, let's say, because she wants it immediately, but he cannot put anyone immediately. So he told her in the morning, and she said, "Okay, I'm satisfied. Says so this is the best you can do." So she is quite satisfied, not very satisfied. Here we have learning uh, tip. Nasiha, because when you are listening to someone, try to notice the speaker tone of voice the way the speaker sound can be it uh, can tell the uh, tell you a lot about their attitude okay من التون عرفنا انه احنا انه هي ما كانت كلش ستسفاي عن ال uh, عن انه هو راح يوفر لها شخص يصلح لها الطابعة uh, باشر uh, او in the morning Okay, um, she's not quite satisfied, uh, not very satisfied, quite satisfied. The not kulish kulish, uh, sorry, tone kulish muhamma bil English speaking because it, can, it could tell a lot, okay, about the person you are speaking to. Now we will listen for a second conversation, okay, so also pay attention and. Uh, 
because there's a couple of exercise to be done uh, I left them for you in a slide uh, so you can see them directly and do them um, and also you can find them in your notebook in page 46 okay uh, um, you know if you would like to do them manually uh, for this point thank you so far and pay attention for the voice record that you are going to listen to Recording 4. A. I'm sorry, we won't be able to repair it for at least four weeks. B. I'm afraid we can't send anyone until tomorrow afternoon. C. Oh yes, you're light. It will be another fortnight before we can replace that. D. We don't have any heaters in stock. I've got no idea when we'll get any more. E. No, we can't send anyone to help you. All the lads are out at the moment. F. John is away on holiday and won't be back for two weeks, I'm afraid. There's really not very much we can do before then. Okay, uh, since this is the last lecture we have in this course of listening and speaking, then I will emphasize on certain point. Um, in this course, we, let's say, talk about a lot of issues, we learn a lot of vocabularies, a lot of grammatical structure that help you to sound more like native speakers. Um, uh, it was extraordinary course, okay, depending on the circumstance that we are going through. على الرغم من ذلك انه ظروف كان صعبه بس اتوقع انه قدرنا نتعلم بي قدرنا هواي اوكي اي تراي از هارد از بوسيبل تو ميك ات ات از مور انجويبل كورس اوكي اند اي هوب اي يو لايك ات اوكي سو اخر نقطه احب مو من اخر ما قبل الاخير احتمال اوكي من اخر النقاط اللي احب انه اذكرها هي الديفرنت بين امريكان اند بريتش اكسنت Okay, so uh, my class is about listening and speaking, so uh, I will try to show you the differences between these two uh, different accents. American English be Hawaii accent, be American, British, um, South African, Australian, Canadian, Indian. Uh, I already did a video in the group on a person called I want some water in different accents. I don't know if you know that it's the same language. بس شلون من من تختلف الاكسنت شلون طريقه اللفظ بشكل كامل تختلف اليوم انا راح اركز بس على الامريكان والبريتش لانهم شلون نقول اكثر اثنين آه حاليا الطلاب يحبون يتعلموهم او اكثر اثنين انتشارا اوكي مو مثل يعني فرضا الاستراليا ولا الكنديين يجون بعدهم فالامريكان والبريتش هم اللي بال شلون بالواجهه فالفرق بيناتهم أربع محاور. The first uh, thing is grammar, with the uh, spelling, or pronunciation, or vocabulary. يعني إيش نقصد؟ نجي للgrammar. بالgrammar ال هل يختلف الgrammar مات البريتش عن الأمريكان؟ مو الgrammar التكس وأنا ما بالحياة اليومية. Structure اللي يستخدموه الأمريكان يختلف عن البريتش just a little bit. For example, the British people uh, يستخدمون a lot of tag question شنو tag question؟ انه تقول جملة مثبتة وآخر شي تقول سؤال بيها يعني she's pretty isn't she؟ she is pretty isn't she؟ فبهاي الحالة هي جملة مثبتة وآخر شي isn't she؟ يعني أنا بدي أسأل المقابل أوكي؟ فال tag questions the British people use it a lot in daily life أوكي؟ but to be more if you would like to sound more British أوكي؟ in your speaking so use tag question in your speaking second point أوكي النقطة الثانية من الجرامر إنه ال British people يستخدمون المضارع التام why أوكي؟ بينما ال American people know they use the past simple نجي للفرق زين؟ فرضا عبارة إنه إذا 
a text search for example um, I have broke your phone okay hi British people say I don't know يعني أنت كسرته okay بهاي الحالة إنه الفعل إنه تليفون كسر هاي it has been done the British people يستخدمون مضارع التام okay لأن ال شلون نتائج الكسر بعدها إنه ما صلح الموبايل so I have broke your phone بينما الأمريكان بي ويل نو they use a simple uh, past uh, so he will say I broke your phone okay الأمريكان use past simple British use a present perfect هاي بالنسبة للجرامر نجي هسه للفوكابلاري بالنسبة للفوكابلاري <hesitation> أكو يعني مصطلحات قليلة يعني مو كلش very very weird الأمريكان بيبل يوز أبارتمنت البريتش يوز فلات أوكي <hesitation> أنا حطيتلكم ياهم هنا أنا باللست أوكي <hesitation> فور إكزامبل كلمة كاندي و سويت الكاندي فور أمريكان من يقولون حلويات أوكي ذا يقولون كاندي البريتش يوز سويت العلبة فور بيبسي كولا العلب هاي الحديدية أوكي الصغيرة يحطون محتويات غذائية بيها الأمريكان يوز كول إت can why the British name it tan okay also the taxi cab for American taxi for British people okay and you have the rest of the list you can check number three which is the spelling okay I cover up the spelling pen American and British accents and I'm going to be came up with American to the fan British a this didn't pass it okay for a أو الكلمات كلها اللي يمكن موجودة بالإنجليزي اللي فرق بيناتهم أنا حاطط لكم إياهم هنا أنا هي كلمات مثل كلمة honor دائما إذا تلاحظون ممكن كتب بطريقتين كلمة color أوكي آه كلمة travel um, and the rest of the word إنه كل ذول هم بس الكلمات أوكي من بين تقريبا ملايين الكلمات الموجودة بالإنجليزية the last difference between them is in pronunciation هو الأهم فرق okay. uh, the British people do not pronounce the R sound except when it is followed with a, fa- uh, with a by a v- vowel so um, while the American people pronounce the R sound whenever it occur okay هذا أهم فرق بيناتهم باللفظ for example uh, my father uh, in the car okay this is the British way my father in the car Okay, here we have father and car, it's end with R. Okay, while the American people say, my father in the car. Okay, so you look, there is huge difference with the pronunciation because there's more emphasis on the R. Also, there is um, the, uh, the pronunciations of all, uh, all sound is different between the two languages. But all in all, uh, the... Uh, the the more emphasis is on the pronunciations of R. Since we don't have time, I will not go deal with the all and also the teeth sound because it is sometimes different between the two accents. Uh, accent story. بعد نقطة مهمة intonation. British people, I think, from my perspective, use um, intonation more. Okay, when they speak. Okay, نقطة ثانية أحب أحشي بها اللي هي uh, so about your writing your so about your writing your report since you have different titles but still the strategy of writing is the same uh, first thing you should do uh, YouTube شوف شوفوا فيديوهات عالية زين راح تحصل كل الأفكار الموجودة لأن اللي يسوي فيديو باليوتيوب أكيد هو دارس على الموضوع ومطلع عليه ومرتب أفكاره بطريقة سلسة لما تطلعون على اليوتيوب آه أنصحكم إنه دور تقرون عنه بشكل عام بالجوجل بس تكتب الموضوع بعد رفته وتدو ريسيرش تطلع لك ويبس آه صفحات هواية إلكترونية آه بس من تكتب أنت مطالب تستخدم آه مصادر ف. اكتب الموضوع مالتك نفسيته واكتب وياه عبارة بي دي اف راح تنزل لك كلها كتب الكترونية على مود كتب او مقالات على مود انه شلون يصير عندك توثيق قوي اوكي يعني فرضا انا من اقرا فرضا الطالب كاتب لي من الانترنت قبل يختلف من اقرا الطالب كاتب من مقالات وكتب الدرجة راح تختلف اوكي لان المعلومة موثوقة تكون اكثر 
at the end of the day thank you very much and i wish you all the best in your life um i i hope you really uh, benefit from that course and um, and above all enjoy that course um wish to see you soon as a successful people